In this lesson, we are gonna learn how to add and subtract functions. It's gonna be really easy. I'll show you what we mean. So here we have two functions, h and g. Okay, so those are the two different functions. And what they want us to do here is they just want us to subtract them. So they want us to take h, which is, um, so we can say h minus g of t equals to h's equation, which is 3t minus 2, subtract, and then g's equation. But now g's equation is more than one term, so you must put that in a bracket. That's where a lot of learners make mistakes, is that that second one must go in a bracket, because this negative is going to go there, but it's also going to go there. And so you're going to end up with 3t minus 2, take away t cubed, plus 1, and so that's going to give us, uh, now we just simplify, so 3t minus one, because minus two plus one is minus one, minus t cubed. And there we go, that's the answer, let's do another one. So here we have two equations, g and h, and here they would like us to add them. When you add, you don't have to use brackets if you don't want to, but if you do want to, that's also fine. So we're gonna go g plus h, and that's gonna give us four t take away five plus now, you can just put the negative like that if you want to, that's fine. And so this positive and this negative is just going to make a negative, so let's just write that in the next step. And so now we just simplify. So 4t and 2t, that gives us 6t, take away 5, take away t squared. There we go. If you want, you can then arrange it in, from like some people like to put this one in the front and then this one. And then that one. So if your teacher is very strict about that, then of course that's a very easy step to do. Now this next one's quite interesting. They want us to add them together. And then normally this would have said t. I mean, sorry, not t, we're using x here. So that usually would have said x. But here what they're saying is go add them together. Once you're done adding them, plug in minus 4 wherever you see x. That's what that means. So we're going to go h plus g. So let's just first go add them together. So we're just gonna leave it as x. So that's gonna be three x take away four plus x take away five. And that's gonna give us four x because that's what those two give. And then negative nine, there we go. Now, if we wanna plug in a negative four, then we just go like that. So wherever you see x, you'd plug in negative four and that's gonna give you negative 16, negative nine, and that's gonna be negative 25. 